Hello everyone. Today I am going to share a new library for Proteus, which is Gas Sensor Library for Proteus. Uh, in this library, I have designed gas sensors, and in total, I have designed eight gas sensors, which I have placed in this library. So, these gas sensors are look alike as shown in this figure. I have designed total 8 gas sensors starting from MQ2 to MQ9. So you have MQ2, MQ3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Uh, I hope you have tested on these gas sensors and if you know then these sensors are used to detect different gases in the atmosphere like MQ5 is used for sensing methane gas, MQ2 is used for sensing uh, H2 hydrogen gas. So these different sensors are used to detect different gases in the environment or atmosphere around you. So as we know that uh, protein is a simulation software, so we can't uh, make the gas around any sensor in real. So what I did is I have placed the test pin in each of these sensors. So when you apply a high signal on this test pin, then it will be like the sensor has detected some gas in these surroundings. So uh, using these sensors, using this library, gas sensor library, you can simulate all these sensors in your Proteus software. So first of all, what you need to do is you need to download this gas sensor library by clicking this button. When you download it, it will ask for start download and now open it. It will contain three files in it. And these files are named as gas sensor and .idx. So extract these files in the library folder of your Proteus software, which in my case is here. library folder and click OK. As I already have these files, so it's asking me to confirm. So I'm confirming yes to all. So all these files are replaced in my in the library folder of my Proteus software. Now I'm gonna restart my Proteus software. I'm using Proteus 7 by the way. So now in the component section I'm gonna search for gas sensor. And here are all these sensors which are present in this library which is named as gas sensor TEP. Uh, this one is not included, uh, that one is for testing. So anyways, these are all the sensors. So I'm gonna place them here and you can see these are exactly the same as we have seen in the image. These are different sensors. 5, 6, MQ, 7, 8, and the last one is MQ, 9. So these eight sensors are available in this uh, gas sensor library and you can quite easily now simulate any of these sensors in your Proteus software. So for instance let me design a small circuit to show you how it's gonna work. So I'm gonna use right now MQ5 sensor and you can use any of them because they all are working exactly the same. So another thing I'm gonna use is logic state and I'm gonna select uh, uh, screen time. I'm gonna select this one logic state and I'm gonna simply connect it with this test pin. Now if I run this sensor, sorry, uh, another thing you need to do is you need to add the functionality in this sensor. 
and in order to do so you have to give it a path for gas sensor tb dot hex we just downloaded this file and we have placed it in the library folder of our uh, software i'm clicking ok now if i run it you will see if i click it one there's nothing happening on the outpin because i haven't provided it vcc and ground so i'm gonna give it ground here on ground pin and i'm gonna give power here on its vcc pin now when it's on its out pin is also on means it's giving high here in simple words our mq5 is now detecting the gas that's why its out pin is high if i click it zero low then you can see now our out pin is out pin is of zero so uh, uh, in simple words it's now it's not detecting the any gas in the atmosphere so high and out pin is high that's how you can simulate this mq5 sensor in proteus again the only thing you need to do is you need to add the gas sensor tv dot hex file which we just downloaded and placed in the library section you just need to add it here in the program file section so that your gas sensor works properly and now it's ready to use um, in the next tutorial i'm gonna share interface this sensor with arduino hopefully so till next tutorial take care bye bye subscribe us uh, subscribe our youtube channel and also sub subscribe our blog so okay take care bye bye